Hi guys, you're watching Interesting and Fickers. This is a new episode of The Tree House. In the last video, we have refined our house, we have sheeted the walls with clapboard, made furniture, a bed, a table, and chairs from forest materials. We also add some crockery and made shelves. Today, we'll finally expand our buildings and build a sauna on a tree. We're planning to make the framework and walls of our future steam room. Our future sauna will be right above my head near the pine tree. As you can see, we've already made an evacuation plan and made an additional ladder. There to the attic will have another entrance directly from the house. Well guys, if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, then click the button below and subscribe it right now. We're gonna have some amazing projects. Also today we want to make a savage system in our house that is we'll install a wash basin and in order to drain the water into the cellar, we'll put such a pipe, take a hole, disguise it under the tree and will be possible to wash our hands there. In the future, want to make a toilet there, but Fikas doesn't want to. I want a kitchen there. Maybe the kitchen or toilet, but in any case, we need a wash basin and a drain. What are you doing now? This is a bed for the future drain of the kitchen sink. Or toilet. Kitchen sink. Toilet. Kitchen sink. In general, guys, this is a drain pit. So that the walls of our drainage pit don't fall apart inside, we overlay the walls with the help of such logs. So as we see, we're already starting to make the framework for our sauna. This will be our floor and the stairs will serve as our support. Here you go. What a high. I thought it would be even smaller, but it's fine. Yeah, I think here we'll have a stove furnace and here we'll sit down. The main thing is that we'll make the ceiling as high as possible, because of this we'll have more space and the benches will be high. There's all the temperature, all the heat will condense at the top and it will be hottest there as in any sauna. I propose here in this pediment to hang a curtain and make a restroom there. You move the curtain aside, come in and lie down, rest and then again go to take a steam bath. It's really high. Yeah. How many meters are there? Three or four? It's like a three-story house. Guys, we were afraid that it would be ugly if we didn't overlap. We did it just enjoying and everything seems to be beautiful. It may need to be stained. Write in the comments which color to choose. Everything looks good. The board is flat and everything is cool. It looks like a balcony. I think there is enough room for a sauna. On this side somewhere we'll put a stove, sheet up the wall with tin so that the tree doesn't burn and everything will be great. Here it will be necessary to sheet everything up and install the drawer here, because the heat shouldn't come out of the sauna. In general, there is still a lot of work to do today, so let's do it. Today we'll have on the menu a traditional hot banus. This is a kind of corn porridge that is cooked with sour cream and milk. To it will be added bacon greaves and mushroom dressing in a creamy sauce. I have never tasted this dish myself, but today I'll try to cook it and hope it will be very tasty. While the mushrooms are fried, I decided to work on the letters that will be attached to the walls of our sauna. This time they will be thicker than the inscription Ficus Land. Everything should turn out beautifully. After the mushrooms release all water, you can pour in the cream. This time we decided to make our letters below on the ground and then attach them to the wall. Because it's very high there, it will be very difficult to attach one stick at a time. So it's much easier and more practical. Pick a boo! Who's there? So the hole is ready, now we can install our server pipe. Opa. Now we need to mess this pipe with beach bark so that it just looks like a support. This pipe will drain the water into the drain pit. By the way, we bought such a thing today, we'll install it, connect the drain, because I also bought a siphon, so we'll have a full-fledged sink in our house. Isn't that cool? Corn grits are cooked in milk with sour cream. First of all, we pour milk into the pan, then add sour cream into it and stir until it becomes smooth. Hard by Cupid Bay Hurry, I need to be 
When Sergei was working on the sauna, I made banos. According to the traditional recipe, it should be thicker, but we did it well too. I tried it and it tastes great. Sergei, come down. Time for lunch. Well, before I go down to eat, I want to show what we're going to do here. There will be a door right here. I have already marked what the roof will be like. This will be the descent. I think it will be enough for the rain and snow to roll down. Now it remains to sheet up this side and screw the ladders on this side. So let's check out how the dish turned out. Hot banush with mushrooms and a creamy sauce, feta cheese and fried bacon. Bon appetit! You tried? Yes, it's delicious. Looks amazing! I thought it would taste like milk porridge. No, it's a salty dish. I really love mushrooms, but together with all this and bacon, it's amazing. Really cool. Try out this dish, guys. You will certainly like it and then let us know in the comments. This is how we brought the pipe out. Now I'm hammering the stakes into the ground so that they stand steadily. Then we'll cover it all a little so that no debris gets there. And finally, I want to disguise this pipe under a pine trunk. I've already collected some bark from old trees, which were already cut off. Honestly, I don't know yet how I'll attach the bark, but I'll definitely come up with something. So, how's it? Wonderful. Get down, have a look. Since we added more weight to our house, we decided to add supports to the bottom so that it doesn't collapse. To do this, we found another dry log which had already been cut down here. Exactly what we needed. We thought about how to strengthen the bark. There was an option with self-taping screws, but because of them, the pipe may burst. There was also an option just to glue them, but it takes a long time and the bark may simply not stick. We came up with a good option with wire, a thin wire, but this wire is visible. This is a big minus, and we don't know how to disguise it. Write your version in the comments, and next time we'll do it, because it turned out great, but the wire is still visible. So we have already done the drain, now we can try on our sink. It fits perfectly, take a look. We'll put it there, right? Where I wanted to make a toilet? There will be a kitchen here. So as you can see, there will be a drain, we'll connect it today. Now there is where to wash our hands. There is also a window. I'll put the stove here and open it instead of the hood. We have finally bought the battery and are ready to plug it in. You see, I made such a special tons and we can connect it now. They're called battery clamps. Yes, now we connect it. We'll definitely disuse our battery because judging by the fact that our roof was stolen, they can steal anything in the battery too. Therefore, it's necessary to hide it. As you can see, I screwed in a couple of wooden planks here and here. I leveled them up with a spirit level and now our sink can be installed here perfectly. Well, let's try it on. How's that? All good. We can remove the film and wash the apples. Now connect it. So we present to you the latest technological development, a forest washed hand. Let's demonstrate to you how it works. Come on, let's check it out. Oh. It's draining out. So what has been done with the sauna? For it, I used all the boards. There is one wall, there is a second wall. We've also got a door. Look how cool it is, it's heavy. Here we'll have the entrance to our sauna. Now it remains to be sheathing up here, there and the roof. We'll do all this in the next video. We'll not only sheathing up, but we'll also insulate it. Perhaps we'll even sheath it up with a clapboard. But in any case, in the next video, we'll be taking a steam bath here in our sauna. At least we hope so. Now we'll definitely take a steam 
steam bath will make the benches, make a steam room and test it. Therefore, be sure not to miss the next video. In the next video, we'll finish our sauna on a tree and we'll already take a steam bath. Our ficus land is growing and what else to build depends on you. Write all your ideas in the comments and support this video with your likes. By the way, we installed a camera trap and in the next video we'll see what it recorded. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon. It was Ficus and Interesting with you. Until next time. Blah, blah.